In this video, I want to take a look at some horizontal parabolas, um, vertex form of the equation, and then we'll just do a rough sketch of one. All right, um, hopefully that you have the con concept here of a horizontal parabola. Instead of having your x value squared, you're going to have your y value squared. All right, in vertex form then, it's going to be x equals a, some random value out here, times the quantity of y minus k, quantity squared, plus your h. Okay, now you're, it's going to be very, very similar to your uh, vertical parabolas, as in this uh, leading coefficient here, this a out here, this value right here, is going to tell you, all right, about your parabola and how it opens, all right. But instead of either opening upright or upside down, it's going to either open to the right or it's going to open to the left, all right. If it is a positive value, all right, it is going to open to the right. All right, for our horizontal parabola. And to me, I kind of think of that as it's encompassing all the positive values. All right, um, if it is a negative, then it is going to be opening to the left. And again, it would be eating like the negative numbers over there on the number line. Okay, now, um, as with our other uh, vertex form of a vertical parabola, we had our vertex located at HK. All right, now, your vertex is still going to be at h, k. But in vertex form, the h and k's are in different spots. Okay, so um, what you're going to have to remember is that in this case, since the k is on the inside and the k is still my y value in my vertex, um, it's going to tell me how to shift my vertex opposite up or down. Okay, because it's the y value and along the y axis we shift up or down. All right, the value out here this time is my h value. Well, it is still in my vertex, it's still my x coordinate. So then I'm going to move left to right for my x coordinate, so it's going to tell me how to move the same left or right. All right, and this is completely opposite than if you were doing a vertical parabola. Okay. All right, um, so over here, I want to take this uh, general idea here and just do a rough sketch of this horizontal parabola. All right, so let's go ahead and um, put a set of axis out here for me to draw it on. All right, now usually what I do not do is I don't generally pull out the vertex. How with it, however, with this being a horizontal one, it might not hurt us here. All right, so if I want to take a look at my vertex here, Okay, this value out here will be my h. All right, so that's going to be a 2. All right, and then my k value is going to come from in here, and it's got to be opposite there, so it's going to be 4. So at 2, 4 is going to be the vertex of this parabola, and I know because that's positive 2 that it's going to open to the right. All right, however, if I wanted to do this along the lines of shifting, all right, which is usually how I translate all of my graphs, all right, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to start at the origin, and I this right here, this negative 4, would tell me to go up four, so I would shift up four. One, two, three, four. And then this value out here would tell me how to shift left or right. So same two, so then I would be going to the right two. All right, and then there would be my vertex. But again, you know, if you pull the vertex out separately, it still puts me at two, four for the vertex. So it really doesn't matter whether you do it shifting wise or you pull that vertex out. And if all I am doing is a rough sketch and I know it opens to the right, then I can just do something like that. All right, not an accurate graph. I don't know how wide or how narrow that is. All right, I'm just doing a really rough sketch here. Okay, but that's just a real quick look at your horizontal parabolas. Thanks for watching.